Hello, this is Eric at the Prince Road Ford Pre-Owned Supercenter, and we're taking a look at the 2018 Ford F-150 in an XLT trim, and powered by a 3.5 liter V6 EcoBoost engine, providing you with plenty of power for towing, hauling, and 4 x 4 with some great fuel efficiency as well, and coming with a bug deflector up front, heavy-duty mud flaps on the front and rear tires, and running boards down below, you've got some nice exterior accessories, does also have airbag suspension installed, um, but let's take a look inside. So first looking in the back seat, we have spacious seating for three that can be folded completely up and out of the way to accommodate any other cargo. And in the center you have two cup holders as well as a 12 volt power outlet, two USBs and a 110 volt power outlet. Now this truck does also have a remote start installed, so no need to go outside on those cold mornings to warm up your vehicle. And looking in, you have power windows, power mirrors, and power logs, as well as a fully power adjustable driver seat. So now sitting in the truck with it running, you can see it's sitting at 60,869 kilometers. But moving down the steering wheel, on the right hand side you have your hands-free phone and radio controls, and on the left hand side you have your cruise control buttons, as well as your controls for your center screen. Where you can cycle through information such as your distance to empty, your transmission temperature, tire pressures, digital speedometer, engine info, and then you can also go into your trip and fuel, so your trip one and two stats, and then your fuel economy, your towing status and information, your off-road status, and then settings oops, for features around your vehicle and uh, just your screen setup in general. But then moving on to your center, your infotainment screen, which is radio, Sirius, CD, and Bluetooth. So you do have some options there for whatever you want to listen to, however you want to listen to it. You have your Bluetooth phone controls and your navigation screen, so you're hopefully not going to get lost on your travels. And whatever apps you may have installed. And then settings for your screen and some other features around your vehicle. But then shifting into reverse, you do also have a backup camera with reverse sensors that will alert you if you're about to hit anything, so hopefully you can avoid that does also have dynamic hitch views, so you can zoom in on your hitch and hopefully have an easier time hooking up a trailer or something. Then above that you have your hill descent assist, your traction control shut off, your hazards, and your auto start stop. So when your vehicle is sitting idle, the engine will shut off to cut down on emissions and save you some fuel. Uh, quickly moving over to your column shifter, which does have select shift, so you can manually shift through your gears. And then your drive mode selector for your uh, tow haul, snow wet, eco, and sport modes. But then moving on, uh, below your screen you have your physical media and climate controls with heated front seats with three levels each so you can customize how warm you are. To the left of that you have your 4x4 controls with a locking rear differential as well as your pro trailer backup assist beneath it and your trailer brake controller. Then over on the right side you have a 12 volt and 110 volt power outlet. Then down here you have this compartment which has two USBs and some space, so you can plug something in there. Then you have your two cup holders, cubby cubby, and your center locking compartment slash armrest here, which has a removable tray and is otherwise very spacious and even has another 12 volt power outlet inside, so you can plug something in there too. And um, last but not least, you do also have a power sliding rear window, if that's something that interests you but that should cover our look at the interior. So now if you're interested, feel free to give us a call at 250-563-8111 or just come on down to the dealership and have a look for yourself and have a nice day.